If you love me, I got a word for the both of us. Put you in the driver's seat. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. It's me, Evie. I know you all have probably been like, girl, what have you been? Did you fall off the face of the earth? No, y'all. I've just been trying to figure it out, trying to see what direction I wanted the channel to go in. And I'm like, you know what? Just live your life. Just live your life and record. And so that's what I'm going to do. Come along with me. This is more like a video journal of my life. Um, I'm not sure if in the last vlog I talked about moving to Houston, but yes, we have relocated. We're in the Houston area. We've been out here just enjoying all of the great food. New Orleans, Houston on y'all ass. Y'all better come with it because it's on and popping here. We have hit up so many of the popular restaurants and it, it has all been seriously fantastic, y'all. And we didn't even scratch the surface of the restaurants. So I'm sure in these vlogs, you'll see me at a lot of places trying a lot of different foods. I'm a foodie, um, you know, along with other things. But again, come along. I would love for you guys to subscribe to my channel, become a part of my family. You know, your family anyway, but I need you to click that subscribe button. Turn on your post notification bells and share. Be right back. I'm in Joe Joby's Smart Shop. It is um, a subsidiary of HEB. And so they have, it's an HEB store, and they carry all of the HEB brands at a discount. So we came here to check it out to see what they have. I'm getting ready to start juicing. And so I came here basically to get some fruit, but to pick up. You know anything else that I can find? Yes, I'm so sorry. Come shopping with me. The uh, grapes look good. Green grapes. How much is that container down there? Do I have the price? Premium grapes, two ninety seven a pound. Yeah, them right down. Yes, right. Fuji apples, a dollar forty-seven a bag. How many of you want to get? Um. Two. If you're gonna be juicing, it's gonna be the basic. Most of the most of my ones. Okay. Three seventy-seven for four pounds. I'm gonna get two of those. This is cheaper than the regular ATV price. But I can get two of these at Walmart for the same price. But I don't feel like going to Walmart today, so I'll get extra later. I'm comparing the prices to the regular ATV store. And so far, I think it's cheaper, but I do see things like the guacamole is still the same price. This is all the fruit, and now we're going to try to find a watermelon and maybe go check out the meats. Hey, I'm juicing, right? So it's okay to get this. It's like pina colada juice, right? They two twenty seven for Bacardi. You get two. You know, I'm taking it easy. Take it easy. Look what I see. 
I think this is everybody's favorite spot in Target, the dollar spot. I came in here to get these little containers to put creamer in for my coffee videos. And I came across this super cute little Easter decoration. For kids, it kind of makes them think that the Easter Bunny came. Now this is a really cool cup. It has a whole snack bowl attached at the top. Now would I be wrong if I bought this? I really do like cups, y'all. It was tempting, but I put it back. I really do have a problem when it comes to glasses and mugs. Pretty things, just it's just hard for me to say no. This one was, I think, $7, and then there was some more. I think this one was $10, but I didn't get any. Now, is it that serious for me to be sitting outside of Ross this time of morning? But I guess so. Um, I'm excited. I want to spruce up my kitchen a little bit more. I'm going to change my coffee area around. And I saw these nice chopping boards and um, a couple things in Ross. So as soon as they open up this door, I guess I'll go up in here and see what I could get my hands on. I'll see y'all inside in a minute. Now this don't look nothing like the kitchen section, but of course I had to come over here. Look at these shoes, y'all. I don't know what y'all think about them. They are made by Uggs. I don't know. I would rock them. I could rock them. And they're $30. I've been wanting one of these dry brushes, um, but I would be a little leery about buying it out of here. It's $3.99. See that piece of hair up in there? Mm -mm, that's why I can't do it. Umbrellas are pricey, but I think this is an okay deal. I'm gonna pick this up for my husband. It's $7.99. The other one's marked. This one isn't marked. I'm gonna get that one. This is $7.99. He needs a new umbrella for work. Now this is the section I'm supposed to be in. This is so pretty. Oh, I wish it was clear. It's $4.99. That's so pretty. I'm tempted to still get it. Look at that purple one. This one is $3.99. So cute. These are different. We have a lot of them too. Ooh, look at these. That's pretty. That's pretty too. Well, let me get out of here because I'm going to pick up something that I don't need. Like this. I like it. I like this too. I might get this. Here's another one. Mason glasses. It's like the original mason glasses. It's for um original mason jar glass, I guess. Four of them for $5.99. Wow. Okay, so this is the aisle that I'm supposed to be on. I have picked up everything but what I really came in here for. So, I got one of these the other day. But I'm looking for something similar to this. Ooh, that's heavy. And it's $7.99. I like that. This is pretty. There's a smaller version. Look at the cheese plates. Cheese tray. It's $13.99. This one is $12. Decisions. So should I do wood? Should I do wood or marble? Mm -hmm. 
gonna get one of these too. Now all I need to do is find me a small wooden paddle, like a paddle board like this. But I want it to be all wood. wood. Score. This is three ninety nine. Yeah, so after all of it, I get to the register. Try to take this out the cart. I hit the corner on the register and broke it. I gotta come back and get another one. So, FYI, be careful. Let's try this again. All right, y'all. Now, this is too much. I get all the way to the car, and the lady forgot to put the umbrella in the bag. So, after carrying all that, y'all see how I'm sweating? Ooh, we in Texas, child, and this big jacket ain't helping. But um, it was, like, in the 50s, I think, when I left the house. But it's hot as hell now. But anyway, I had to put all that crap in the car and then go back to get my husband's umbrella. I think she could have walked it to me but i guess she couldn't leave her register man it's a crazy day starting off with just walk wow i was supposed to be going to uh make me some coffee but i'm gonna need a drink i'm not used to this shopping no more i'm used to ordering my shit online and picking it up <sighs> all right next up now, why the fat in me want to go to nothing but cakes? I'm a baker, y'all. That's what I do. But I like to try, you know, other people's cakes. Um, and to be honest, I don't really eat cake like that. But every now and then, I want to try someone else's cake. And I've had nothing but cake. And I've had nothing but cake. And it's just all right to me. But for some reason, I guess just because I see there's a new nothing but nothing but I can't talk. Just because I see there's a new nothing but cake by me. You know, the fat girl trying to get me to go over there. But I'm not doing that. Because I don't even want cake, y'all. So let me take my butt on home. Man, temptation is a mother. I ain't doing it. I'm getting on the highway. Going home. Let me ask y'all a question. Do y'all use um, the Nextdoor app? Baby. When I tell you them folks don't miss nothing, they know everything that's going on. So in my area, back here, they're building something. I don't know what it is. Kind of look like a hospital, but then they have cleared out so much land. Hold on, let me put the camera Child, I don't know what they building back here, but they just put this up. This whole frame came up like yesterday. That's how fast they moving. But right here, I'm trying to figure out what is this going to be. Kind of look like maybe a hospital. I don't know, but it's huge. I promise you, I can log into the next door app and they know what's going on. They be all up, all up and through the business. So ain't no signs. I almost stopped and asked the construction workers like, what's up? What, what's going on with it? Um, probably more stores. What is all of this on the road? Probably more stores or something. I'm not sure, but, um, we shall see. We shall see. Just give me a few. Yeah, the house we just passed right there. Every time we pass by, I raise my hand. Thinking them in advance. I'm gonna have one like that soon. So, all right, I'll see y'all in a second. Baby, you gotta hide your wife, hide your kids. Look at that hawk on top of the people, on top of the house, y'all. 
That's how they be in our neighborhood. Whole hawks on top of the house. So I stay inside. When I see those hawks swarming, I take it on in the house. We in the country. All right, I made it home. I know I said hawks. I think those things are vultures. That's what it is. And yes, they be flying all over the neighborhood because we out here in the country surrounded by ranches with horses and cows and all kinds of stuff like that. The neighborhood is in the middle of all these farms. So anyway, let me hurry up and unload this car and get inside before I get hawked before I get attacked. Be right back. Thank you. So you're gonna take a doofy? Follow me on Instagram at K Sign J. That's K A S A U N J. See, we gon' pop by that raccoon, yeah. It's all black like a goon, yeah. That chopper clear the whole room, yeah. And sweep them up, grab the broom, yeah. Pop out with them rats out. Blow the mama back out. Hit it, make a tap out. I said, pop out, pop out with them racks out. Blow the mama back out. Hit it, make a tap out. Happy birthday, Tiana. Happy birthday to you. Oh, man. Hey, Mimi, Mom. Can I take a picture of my. Oh, God. 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 Oh, God.